See, I don't care who you are, everybody wants to be happy and everybody wants to be successful. Everybody. I don't know nobody that don't want to be happy or successful. And if you're hanging around people that won't, that won't be happy or successful, you should get away from them. If you want a tree to really grow up and really be a beautiful tree, you got to prune it. You got to prune it every now and then. If you, if you ever, well, I'm from the country, so if you're growing corn, you got to hold the road. You got to get the weeds out. If you don't, they're going to stifle the growth of your product. Remember when they used to show rockets going to the moon and they used to show it in Cape Canaveral or Cape Kennedy, wherever they shoot it from, you see a rocket on the ground that's got these four big boosters. When that rocket comes off the ground, two of them boosters stay right there. Them two boosters is just enough to get this big thing off the ground. Two of them stay attached. Then when that rocket go up, you can see and they used to tell you, uh, the next fuel tank is coming off, boom. And now it's just one fuel tank because in order for it to get all the way up to where it's going, it has to shed that dead weight. In order to get off the ground, some people in your life just for a season, they just, they just ground level people. They can't go up in the air with you now. And, and you got to remember something my daddy told me, everybody come with you, can't go with you. You can't keep dragging people with you, man. So now you got these two boosters and one of them come off. Now in order for that rocket to get into orbit, you have to lose that last fuel tank. Because guess why? It's out of fuel. It's out of season. You done went to an area that that fuel tank can't handle. If you keep that fuel tank on that rocket ship when it go in the orbit, you're going to blow the whole mission. You're going to blow the spaceship up because it ain't got no business going that high. Now, you can insist on taking it if you want to. The problem you're going to have now is your rocket ship ain't going to get into orbit. And do you know that's what's happening to a lot of people? You can't get where God trying to take you because you're trying to take everybody else with you. Everybody come with you, can't go with you, man. I'm sorry. If God had wanted them in orbit with you, he'd have put their rocket ship in orbit. It ain't your job. You can't chain people to your rocket ship and take them into orbit. You know, I had to learn this, man. Do you know I was taking people with me, man? Trying to keep it real. My boys in the hood was holding me to that. Man, you got to keep it real, man. Don't forget where you come from. We your homies. Yeah, 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 okay. Okay. You can't have people go to certain places with you. Y'all, y'all got to do this culling. You got to cut your, you got to cut the cord with some of these people. They holding you down. I'm just trying to give you some piece of advice. Next thing I want you to remember is, look, man, God is important. He's important to your journey. He love to hear from you. Talk to him today. You ain't got to clear it with nobody. God is available 24-7. You don't need an appointment. You ain't got to be on your knees. Just talk to God. He'd love to hear from y'all. Thank y'all for coming, everybody.